Hey guys, today we're going to learn how to concatenate strings with bash. So this is pretty easy. Um, now we're, we're going to basically run this all from the command line rather than create a script. Um, you know, I may throw together a quick script too. Basically everything you run here as a script, um, like this is a mini example script. You could, you could also just uh, run this from the command line. Um, so anyways, if you have the the quick answer is if you have two two strings, say in, for example in a variable called a and b, you just uh, specify them like this, and um, well you know I, I'm gonna you know I take that all back. I'm just gonna create a, a test script right now. So um, bi test one dot sh. All right. So I think this is probably gonna be the easiest way to show you. I'm just gonna copy this right here. Now, if you want, if you want to be able to copy and paste this yourself or look at any of this information for reference, just check the link in the description. This is our guide showing you how to do the exact same thing that we do in this video. So, um, yeah, just check the link in the description. All right, so we have two strings. We have the A string and the B string. Now, um, if you want to concatenate them, if you want to specify a string, you say dollar sign A to refer to the the A string and dollar sign B to refer to the B string, the variable A and B. You just refer to them like that and close them in, uh, in quotes like that and assign them to a new variable. So you've concatenated those two strings into a new variable called C and then we echo that variable out to print the new string. So um, let, let's give this a shot. Let's write and quit. So save our file and let's r just run it. Test one. I have not made this executable yet, so all right, let's schmod that and let's try running it. All right, there we go. Apples and oranges are good. So it prints out that whole string, right? So you have the first string is apples and oranges, second string is are good. We concatenated them together. We have one string now. Now, let's say if you just wanted to echo out all of those. So, A, B, and C. So, first string is apples and oranges. Second string is are good. And then concatenated together, apples and oranges are good. Okay, so there you go. That's um, <clears throat> relatively straightforward. That's just concatenating two strings by themselves. But say if you wanted to include them with a string literal. So let's create a new script and I'll, I'll tell you how this works. And just a better example, just to you know give you a better idea of how to concatenate strings and how to work with this. So test1.sh, all right, let's uh, clear the whole thing out and paste this new script in here. So we have three variables, a, b, and c. Um, apples, oranges, and rocks. Now you can stick them inside here. You can use a dollar sign A, dollar sign B, dollar sign C to refer to the variables A, B, and C. You place them within the string. So we're going to echo out a string. This is the whole string, and you can just insert your variables in like this, this, and this. Right. So you can, can you concatenate your variables together with additional string info like that. So. We're gonna run this, and there you go. I like to eat apples and oranges, but not rocks. There you go. So we've concatenated all those strings together. That should pretty much cover everything you need to know, or at least all the basics anyways. So hopefully you found this useful, or at least interesting, if nothing else. You might wanna give me a thumbs up. Um, you might wanna hit that subscribe button also, and uh, hit the little bell icon up. Otherwise, uh, YouTube's probably not gonna let you know when we come out with a new video. Um, we do have a lot of great stuff coming up, on, and we've actually, if you want to check our list of videos, we've already put out a lot of uh, pretty interesting things, some more interesting than others. Um, we cover a lot of great stuff, um, coding, servers, hardware, software, 3D printing, electronics, uh, single board computers, robots, networking, all sorts of great tech-related stuff that you're not going to want to miss. So if you, if you want your YouTube feed to uh, you know, be that much more interesting, you're going to want to hit that subscribe button. But more important than any of that stuff, you're going to want to leave a comment down below, especially if you know something that I don't know. 
um, definitely let me know, not just for me, but for the next person who comes along and watches this video and reads the comments. Um, leave a comment that for them also. Any, any comments, questions, criticisms, whatever you want to say, I probably want to hear it. So do leave a comment down below. And uh, that's pretty much it for today. So as always, thanks for watching, and we'll see you guys next time.